hello and Merry Christmas it's an update video I will oh Merry Christmas that's the greeting hello and oh the setting of this of this video I have of course my my trusty Bible and my papers and I will show you if you can see any quality in it there's the candle right it's homemade. It's just on a little pad that's sort of a coaster or bottle opener. There is my candle. You see it flickering. It has various quality to it. Sometimes it's really bright and nice, and other times it's not. And then sometimes I film my videos at night, and sometimes during the day. I don't know if you can tell the, uh, the desktop here is, is wood. It's part of the setting, I think. It makes me feel a little more fancy and proper. Okay, so there's the setting. Sometimes I do this during the day. Sometimes it's very early in the morning before anyone gets out of bed. And I mean like really early. Sometimes I'll do this at like four. And then other times, like sometimes you hear me pause because there's the lunch whistle at noon in this little town where I live. So there's that. And then an apology. So. I've got, yep, an apology. So, but it's, 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 it, it comes from the method. So, I started this whole process wrong. And I mean mathematically, when I divided up the Bible. You see my scratch pad here with figuring out what's where. You see, oh, Bible Broadcasting Network is great. They're on the radio. They have a website you can find. They, uh, they have a very simple myth mission of spreading the Bible. Now, they're not paying me. Like I said, I, I'm not monetized here, and I never will be on this channel. Because the whole point of this is to spread the word of God. So, anyway. So, I've got numbers here, because I think I might be experiencing cognitive decline, but I'm not sure. Like, it's not serious enough to actually get it looked at. It's just an excuse. So, it's probably no big deal. So... So I looked at the numbers again. I, I, I originally figured out uh, 404 or 346, whatever. I broke the Bible up wrong. So now I've looked at it again, and I've gone to 1,189 chapters total, minus 150 for the Psalms because of the way we do it, right? We have the Psalms separate, counting separately because we do them twice through, and and so that's 100 or 1,039 divided by 3 is 313. So I should have gone to Genesis 1, um, 2 Kings, chapter 1 is 314. That's pretty close to 313. That's good enough to round off, you know. <laughs> and then, uh, and then, so 1189 minus 313, we get 876. And that brings us to Joel at 877 which is also very close to um 876 so that's fine so i was supposed to start at genesis and joel and second kings and um psalms so there's that so i apologize i got that wrong and there's my method and as long as I'm here, I'll show you. This is how I keep track of, of which uh, which readings I'm doing. So I'll have, every time I have a book change, I'll list all four books I'm doing. And then which chapter I'm doing. And then I didn't cross these out. Sometimes I don't cross them out. But I cross it out to keep track easier. And then the one i got to start with next time through. Next time I sit down. And this is not the first page. This one only goes back to Leviticus uh, 17, it looks like. So there's that. There's my method. This page is full. I'm going to switch to the next page. So, all right. So, I got to tell you, after I finish Revelation, you may have noticed I'm doing Revelation already. And you're thinking, yeah, he's almost done with the Bible. But it, that's part of why I've got to apologize. Is because we're not almost done. I'm going to miss a whole bunch if I don't correct it. I'll explain the correction in a minute, because, um, so, I've explained some methods, and I've confirmed, yup, that's an apology. 
Okay, so now, now I was considering because this is somewhat time consuming. I mean, I have to do the recordings, which is faster now than it was at the beginning because I had a lot of practice videos at the beginning. But as I got the hang of it, I'm I'm making fewer unforgivable mistakes that meant for a deleted video um, on my end. And I'm making more simple mistakes that I can usually excuse away. But still, if I have too many for like my own conscience, or if I if I make something just utterly awful, then I'll delete the video and start over. That's a practice video. But, and then, so I upload them and get them, you know, set on a timer. And, and they come out, you know, uh, you, four times a day. The videos come out four times a day the way the way they're supposed to. But uh, so it was pretty time consuming that I had to watch these videos again, you know, to get them a view and a like and a comment, and to uh, to communicate with the comment section. I've had a couple of the comments I've had to absolutely just delete because they were blasphemous. And then I like I like having comments with you guys. Some people have asked questions I don't know the answer to, so that's great. Kind of. It's humbling. Humility's good, right? So it's good. So it was it was it was very time consuming. I was putting some stress on our uh, our home life here. So I was very much praying about whether to whether to stop the whole process and come back to it another time. But then like then one morning I was doing the readings and three out of the four scriptures it was about a month ago. I think it was the ones for about the 21st of November. But anyway, um, just I got a sense from three out of the four of the readings that I did for one set. They all seemed like the theme was to keep doing it. Just like if, if today you hear his voice, harden not your heart. And I think there was one with, with I'm sending messengers out to all the world carrying the scriptures. Something like that. But anyway, so I don't remember exactly what they were. It doesn't matter. But I had scriptures that suggested I had to keep going. So that's what I had to explain. And so my solution is to keep going. <laughs> I mean, I have to keep going. Um, and to correct a couple of things, I have... Remember, I started off wrong. Not only did I start in the wrong place... But because I started trying with um, like basically 20 minutes, I was doing the whole day's devotions all in one video. And that messed up my thing that I ended up doing later with uh, playlists. So when I get to the end, I'm going to have to go back basically to the beginning and do about the first 28 days worth with individual chapters. And... Uh, so then it'll be, what was it, 313 days plus 28. So that's what I'm going to end up doing for the whole thing. And that will conclude this uh, this set of Bible videos when I'm done. It's going to be close to a year from when I started. But um, I will conclude these videos, and imperfect as they are, they are pretty time-consuming. So I'm going to like stop and rest on them. I don't know if I'll be posting any videos after that. Maybe just sort of like refreshers to get the to get the algorithm to keep posting my stuff. Or maybe not. Maybe I won't do anything. Or maybe I'll post a video telling you this new channel that I would love to get up and monetized. And use this one for a springboard into that. But, but I'm still not going to monetize this Bible channel. Because the whole purpose is to spread the Bible for free. Like, But also... Um, I'll, I'll I'll maintain like the comments, you know, make sure that, that it's not getting blasphemous, or that if people have serious questions that that deserve answers, then then the, the, we'll get answers for them. But that will conclude the Bible reading plan I'm on right now. When I finish the Bible through, and then do the 28 individuals, so I can make all the playlists. That's gonna be it. Oh, that's also the continuation is. It is just going to be maintenance after that. I'm going to stop posting the videos because this is um, a very, very worthwhile endeavor. But it's also very time consuming. And uh, my wife, Mrs. Carr, is looking forward to me having a little more time 
to spend with her on my days off and on my days that even when I work, so I don't have to stop and look at the videos several times a day. Okay. God bless you. Merry Christmas. I love you all and I'm praying for you.